How to get this really great technology for automotive use it's also really great for mass energy storage, which is our primary focus, but we want to get people excited about hydrogen right and so the other thing that you can use. A lot of power for is huge huge. Acceleration huge top speeds and that's what this vehicle is all about this is the XP1 and what it does is uh, it basically delivers a lot of power to all four wheels to get to very very fast. 0 to 60 actually 2.2 seconds and a very high top speed over 200 miles an hour. This communicates why hydrogen is so good for automotive right and what you can do with a car like this is you can refill in 3 to 5 minutes and what's unique about that is that this is actually an electric vehicle and not unlike most other battery, like your vehicles you guys have heard of this will actually have the same torque on those motors and it will have the ability to uh, be cool and that's what hydrogen is all about hydrogen stores electrical energy and the bond between the hydrogen molecule itself what this will do is it'll take the hydrogen it'll inject it into this engine it'll pass by a a plates right that plate is called a fuel cell plate right that's going to be a membrane electrode assembly it can have a catalyst on there that catalyst is going to have a reaction with the hydrogen right it's going to separate on the end on the cathode side and there's an electron that's going to charge the vehicle the more hydrogen pass through the higher the power is going to come out of this engine and that power will actually move these wheels and this this car will actually go from the hydrogen energy and it recombines the oxygen on the other side of that neck cathode to basically create water so hydrogen if you imagine two hydrogen atoms sort of locking arms together as a molecule separating releasing electron and then recombining with oxygen to make h2o so your only byproduct is actually water from a vehicle like this so in many ways it's powered by water, because the way that you actually create hydrogen in a green wave is taking water and using process or electrolysis and splitting it up from its basic form. So each hydrogen oxygen so now you're creating oxygen in hydrogen the hydrogen you can actually use animation like this and now you have a green total closed loop system. It comes water again you create hydrogen again. Foreign. This engine can actually last three times longer than most hiders and ninjas and that's because there's a very very cool catalyst technology that preserves the platinum right it does not allow to degrade as quickly and that is why this is so unique in its engine form not just because of the raw power but also because it is durability. This car can go 1000 miles you can refill in. 3 to 5 minutes and the engine can last over a million miles because of that cattle and that's the very exciting things that we're doing here in Columbus with some exciting partners that want to be announcing very very soon. We'll talk all about that locally here too part of what we want to do here. In Ohio is build more stations to build the infrastructure. So you wouldn't ask. What's different number one the cost to come down number two we have this new technology that's much more durable and a product. So there's been able to productivity since then that are actually viable that people can purchase and drive today. What you can do with hydrogen instead of having to duplicate a battery over and over and over and over and over again. For when you still sell store something on very large scale is actually just having larger tank right so large tanks are very cheap for hydrogen. So what you can do for example you take wind you take solar which takes energy very irregularly and you can basically create a bank imagine like any bank you can go to to store your money. So now you're storing electricity today big energy companies want to build solar solar sheep now wind is it's not expensive either they want to build bigger solar farms but it makes no economic sense because there's no way to store the energy when you introduce hydrogen as the energy storage mechanism now you can store huge 100 megawatts all the way to geek wall range with this type of technology and that's exactly what we want to do that is our focus to change and to decarbonize the world by creating a bank of energy that could be used and energy companies are excited about that too and they're going to be an awesome cool stuff with those too as well in the future so yes we will provide that full service range on um, one thing though about the car and it is exciting how uh, there are a few features that i want to point out um you know not only does it look as cool as we wanted the whole idea in our theme is like space technology for the road right now that's not arbitrary we don't just like the way that sounds like this actually has some really cool stuff in it and we do work with NASA on a number of things right so there are several commercialized technologies. We're actually using from NASA that are in this car that are pretty cool in of itself one for storage one for power management. And a few others that are gonna be announced a little bit later but one of them actually is this wing specifically right but this actually wing out is adjustable.